The novelist Selma Lagerlof once referred to Stockholm as the city that floats on water. Built on 14 islands, Stockholm does indeed appear to be floating, particularly on those endless summer days when the sunlight shimmers on the rippling waters. Water, in fact, is a key ingredient in the recipe that makes up Stockholm's beauty. There are quite a few ways to appreciate this fact from the perspective of the water. One is to get out on a boat. You'll find no shortage of canal tours and city tours in Stockholm. Boats are bountiful, in part because before the bridges were built, boats used to be the only way to get around the islands. Many of the boats are as beautiful as Stockholm itself, particularly the coal-fired steamers. There's plenty to explore while afloat, as Stockholm is at the juncture of Lake Malaren that stretches 60 miles in one direction and a 50-mile archipelago that leads to the Baltic Sea. You could also get in the water to experience Stockholm. All you have to do is pull on some waders and obtain a fishing license, and you may be lucky enough to pull out a 20-pound salmon right next to the royal palace in the city center. Dinner doesn't get any fresher or any more local than this. Stockholm's maritime flavor mixes with a very chic and cosmopolitan cool to create a dreamy atmosphere that makes you feel, well, as if you were floating. And more than you may realize, you are.